Hello, it's Scott Manley here, now with Kerbal Space Program 0.19 having been out for a few days. People have been building rovers, so I thought I'd build myself a monstrous rover creation. Look at that thing driving around. There's a previous example I've been messing with, but look at this. It is literally massive, and it also looks like it has a pair of eyes on the front from those air intakes. But that's not the point. This thing is huge, it carries a huge amount of weight, it is completely coated in uh, those new 2x2 two two, um, plates, so it, it's in entirely enclosed, it actually makes, it looks kind of like a battle robot or something, have you ever seen the robot wars and things where they build things and they have armour? Well I, th I think it kind of looks like that. Obviously it has really terrible lateral vision, what with the cockpit being there and well, they only have like a 30 degree field of view. This is mostly like a transporter for transporting something big around. And it'll go a decent distance. It is also nuclear powered. Uh, obviously, we need that to generate the 1.21 gigawatts of power that is needed. Now, but, 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 the best thing is, if I uh, bring it to a stop, I can show you one of the other cool features, yeah. So if I uh, hit one, and two, then we can see we have the other, the other, the sub vehicle. Look at that. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, the sub vehicle, which doesn't want to work very well. Let's go back. <laughs> Let's go back and flight. Restart that flight. I think I might have made that a little top heavy. I thought that by switching into a translation mode, it might save it a little. So now the big secret is out. Yes, indeed. I press one, I press two, and I have my rover, which can race down the runway at even faster speeds than the, the parent rover. So we have a two-stage rover, but that's not all. Because, you know, if you're going to do a two-stage rover, you can take this one step further. And here I come. Oh, oh crap. <laughs> Let's see where it is. That's not there. That's not it. Where? The? It's showing me all the garbage I don't need. There we go. I now have myself the other rover. And it can drive alongside its parent and say hi. Hello. Try to crush me. Ah, crunch. Oh yeah, this one actually has uh, is solar powered. This one isn't nuclear. The other ones are nuclear, but this one's solar powered. It's kind of a cute little one, nonetheless. Look at that, huh? I I, I like the fact that you know the physics engine is just letting this one drive because I can just have them drive all together down the runway. Beautiful, one little happy family there. And yeah, that was my first attempt at a rover. Um, so yeah, I'm Scott Manley, huh? <laughs> Drive safe!